Hello, I would like to talk about the digital economy and tax. Fitting in the digital economy in the international tax rules has been a challenge for a long time. Governments have been considering it since the late 90s without this leading to any major changes in the corporate tax area as yet. That may now change, perhaps as early as 2014. Recent political outrage and multinationals perceived as engaging in sophisticated tax planning to avoid paying their fair share of taxes on local operations may now perhaps also have a profound effect on the tax rules for digital businesses. Technology importing countries have long been frustrated that they could not effectively tax foreign businesses making lots of profits in a country without the need for bricks and mortar local presence. And without such presence, international tax rules do not allow that country to tax. Under current international tax rules, only the head office country can tax such profits and virtually operating businesses can choose where to establish themselves. And that usually is not the country with the highest possible tax rate. The combination of these two factors has now led to unprecedented activity by the OECD and the European Union to urgently look at changing the tax rules for the digital economy. Both organizations have started projects in the last quarter of 2013 and intend to make far-reaching proposals by summer 2014. This may sound perhaps very ambitious, but the international political attention, even from the G20 government leaders, for the subject has never been more intense than now. Urgent consultations with businesses have already started. The deadline for initial OECD process is 22nd of December 2013. There will be a complete rethink of what triggers the right for a country to tax electronic businesses operating from outside that country. The focus will likely shift from bricks and mortar presence criteria to the presence of new forms of intangibles, such as lo local user base, location relevant data and other forms of valuable local market presence factors. For this to really work, there will need to be international consensus. It's quite ambitious to try to achieve that in essentially a couple of months' time. On top of that, European VAT rules will change for electronically supplied services purely within the European Union as of the 1st of January 2015. The year 2014 will therefore become a very important year for the taxation of digital businesses. It seems crucially important to us that businesses operating in the digital economy keep fully up to date on developments in this area. They really should consider providing input in the consultation processes or talk to the industry representatives to ensure that their views are heard. They should also start considering what the fundamental change in the tax rules would mean to their business in general and their legal structure in particular. And we would of course be happy to assist with that. Stay tuned for more on this subject.